I box a head jokes. I don't know. Starts. We ready? We ready? We here? We here? Throwing up the gang signs, throwing up the west side, and the uh, and uh, I don't know what the east side. I, I no, I said whatever you were already doing. I don't west know west side. That's what I was doing. Is that? Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Welcome I back have to no idea what episode. we just would, would, who's this closer? Yeah, I know you don't have a laptop, but still. Episode yeah, one twenty-seven. No, it's like no accessories at all. I know. Yeah. I forgot to bring the things out. I just kind of didn't want to unpack them from their boxes. Nah, leave so, them. You know, and plus. I wish I'd have. Some. Do they have New Japan Funko Pops? Well, the way the internet works, right? We could definitely yeah, look up. Yeah, we could look that up. Yeah. So, um, welcome to episode one twenty seven. Yeah. Okay, I was going to say that. You knows I was going to say that. Yeah, I was going to um, say that. <laughs> so yeah, we're back. We had a pretty action packed week since last Wednesday, since we last recorded on Tuesday. Yeah. So it was a lot. Best of the Super Juniors happened. Yes. Um, the finals. Yeah. Um, then we had UFC 132. Two. Thing. One tw- was it 237? 238? 238. There you go. Sorry, I was way off. I was thinking fight night. That's why. Okay. Um, Super showdown happened. And um, then we had Dominion, New Japan Pro. So, yeah. <laughs> wow. How I said <laughs> Super showdown happened. No, uh, it's not that. So. Funko Pop does have a New Japan thing, right? Uh huh. You have it. That's it. Yes. Trash. I saw this dope ass fucking. I saw crazy. this. What is that? What is a this? Rare new. Some woman had it at Dominion, and it was a Tetsuya Naito um plush bear. Oh, we didn't even clink clink the winter white yeah, L. Yeah, you went right to it. Yeah. I was trying to hold out on it. <laughs> that. Mm-hmm. I want that fucking bear. I always see him. I always see that bear. And I'm I like, what the fuck him. is that bear? But, yeah. So, let's just run through the quick stuff. So Where because, do we start? Uh, I'm starting with UFC because, to be fair, neither one of us had watched it. Um, okay. I did see... The highlights from Tony Ferguson versus Donald Cerrone, and um, that's where we're gonna start. We're that's gonna do the, what the I three miss. Type, um, yeah, exactly. I missed the Tony Ferguson fight. Yeah. <laughs> that's why I was mad that I missed that. I I wanted to watch that fight. Um, mm. I think that was Saturday. Yeah, it was Saturday. My bad. That was Saturday. It's always that's Saturday when I was out after work, so that's why I didn't get to watch it. But, you was um, out like you was knocked out. You was like, <sighs> no, 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 I I was out birthday celebration. Yeah, okay, so. Um, Roaming yeah. around the streets? No, nah, not roaming around the streets. We were down in Solas. It was my coworkers' um birthday celebration for three of them. It was my boy Misa. Happy birthday. My boy Oz. Happy birthday. And Jolene. Happy birthday, guys. I've mentioned Jolene quite a few times before, I think. I think. Anyway, so Sterling it Ferguson nice, um stopped Donald Cerrone in a TKO. His eye was like like they medically stopped. Like the eye was swollen, or like over, like the eyebrow. No, the the eye was swollen. The eye was swollen like very, very nicely. Um, hold on, let me see if I can show you. Yeah, I'll I need a picture to, up yeah. for you people's. Um, Donald. That's wow! Like, and all he does is freaking break dance. Who? Tony Ferguson. Not really. That, well, that's his style, though. It's. Dancing with uh, kind of. Capoeiro. How do you say it? Capoeira. Yeah. Look at his eye. Oh they my god. It. Yeah. They stopped it. His eye. You. you I, no. I get why they stopped it. If you know. Uh, <laughs> they. Yeah. So. I look like a vagina. <laughs> don't say that. Go back to it. <laughs> no, I know that's what he said, but I was just like, don't say that shit. That's exactly uh, what it looks like. <laughs> After that, we had the woman's flyweight. Um, Rather have that on your face than something else. Yeah. Um, <laughs> we had the woman's flyweight, flyweight, flyweight match. Um, Valentino Shevchenko versus Jessica I. How do you get the last name I? Well, Valentino Shevchenko won. I hope it's a stage name. I hope so, too. But, um, yeah. 
Valentina won. And I'm sufficiently, like, you know, I forgot to put my hat on. My bad people. Oh, so they stopped it. They stopped the Tony Ferguson fight after after the second round. Yeah, and yeah, it's because like his you couldn't see him. Yeah, high. so, he, so they didn't even let him start for the third. No. Okay. No. This one, he yeah. Because so. I'm I'm looking. It says it stopped around two five minutes. I'm like, okay, yeah. what does that really mean? That's what it meant. Oh, and this and she got knocked out in in the second round of twenty six seconds. Mm. Yep. She got washed. I want to see then, this card now. Yeah, me too. And then after that, we had the bantamweight. Um, main event i think it was for the titles as well i think henry Cejudo is now holding two titles because he defeated marlon moraes um from brazil in the third round four minutes and 51 seconds into it so uh yeah i think he's a two-weight champ now really yeah if i'm if i'm correct if i remember reading that correctly um yeah it doesn't say on this here thing wiki i could have sworn a I read that he is a two way champ now, so I'm not entirely sure, but yeah. Okay, so Henry Sehuda becomes the fourth UFC fighter to hold two belts at once. So yeah, so um, it was the vacant <laughs> phantom weight title. I was gonna fall. You're holding the hat. Mm-hmm. I thought your hair was holding. If you could see it, just like nah, it's not holding it. But you know, whatever. Um, I think this is my niece's hat. I'm not even sure. It's some kid's hat. <laughs> Don't get lice. <laughs> I'm serious. No, you right. I'm so serious. Right. I'm not trying to be an no, you, asshole. You right. Kids. Now nah, I'm just going to go buy a lice fucking shampoo. Yeah. And put it in there now. <laughs> they should really have like lice repellent at this point. Yeah. They other, should. other than. They should. Yeah, like spray right. it on the hat. Oh, can I see? Exactly. So that's pretty much. That was UFC. Um, well, what? I want to talk about. <laughs> well, There's yeah. other shit that happened, you know. But that was the main card, though. For the no, there was more. But still, that was the main events. Yeah, those are the main events. I mean, you had Taita um, Tuivasa losing to Blagoy Ivanov, and then after that, you had Peter Peter Yan defeating Jimmy Rivera. Oh no, that was just so, the main card. Yeah, that was the main card. I didn't look at the that started at ten. prelims or early prelims. I didn't see any of that stuff. So. It, you know, I was yeah. interested in those I don't know why I always so, go to the prelims. I really don't know you why. always do that shit. I put, always ooh, everyone. So. And just let it play and roam around. So the, the best of the Super Juniors, New Japan, they always deliver, man. Every single time. BOSJ. Like, I could, all the time. I could literally say, like, if I need to see some crazy shit. I could just be like, New Japan, it is decided. Yeah. Right, right. Yeah. Right there, like you're always gonna get some crazy shit for the most part. Well, so. we got we got some new Japan style wrestling in the showdown too. I saw there was a brain buster. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, you talking about you talking about Super Showdown got me tired. Shit, wow, that fast, that quick, that, that was insanely. It was like it came like just like that. You blame a showdown? I would blame showdown. Oh, yeah. so. <laughs> so on the final night of the best of the Super Juniors. Actually, let me see if I have the... Okay, so I have the full results of A Block and B Block. So you had an A Block. Shingo Takagi, Takagi was um the A Block winner. He went 9-0, straight undefeated. No fucks given. He's beast. We know I don't, Shingo's a savage. I don't think... Yeah, he was undefeated in this, but I think mm-hmm. he was undefeated since he's arrived. Since he debuted, yeah, in New Japan. And Will Ospreay is the guy. Will Ospreay is the guy. Um, after that, we have 14 points. Dragon Lee and Taiji Ishimori with both 7-2 and two records in the A block. Then, for, with 10 points, Marty Skrull, 5-4. And, and Sho, actually, 5-4 and four as well with 10 points. So, I was like, I was like, mm. yeah. I was like, okay, Sho. Well, they did, they did really good. Sho and Yo on both sides yeah. did really good. Um, then we have an 8 points, Jonathan Grisham with 4-5 four four and five record. 6 points, Titan at a 3-6 and six record. Titan. Titan? Yeah. Okay. Titan. <laughs> uh, <laughs> in a three is three and six record um and yoshinobu kanemaru with a three and six record as well four points tiger mask four at a two and seven record and takamichinoku rounded out the bottom at oh and nine couldn't get one point just go to the should have got one point he should have at least got one, one point. point um nobody on his bracket got two he should have got who's he beating though Nobody. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's the problem. It's all right. So in B block, we had a 14 point, which was a closer block. Um, yeah. 14 points. Well, Osprey, seven and two. Um, he won the block. We already know this. Ibushi, not Ibushi. Bushi won. Um, well, Bushi, El Fantasmo, 
Ryusuke Taguchi and Yo all had a six and three record. Oh, so Yo had a better record than Sho then. Mm-hmm. Um, oh, oh they yeah, all had six and, and he, three, and they were sitting at twelve yeah. points. So that. But Sho Sho was really going off. The first match they had with with um he had with Shingo uh-huh. was crazy. Nuts. Okay, I got to go back. It was. And watch it's that. the first of. Uh, it's the first one. It's the first, I heard that very one was first nuts, match. Though. Started off. Amazing. I heard it was dope. Yeah. Um, after that, we have a 10 points. Bandido at a 5 and 4, and Robbie Eagles at a 5 and 4 record as well. Okay. Six points. Rocky Romero, 3 and 6. It's not a bad turnout for him not being in the tournament for a long time. Him not wrestling in a long yeah, time. Yeah, exactly. Him not doing singles wrestling in a long time. Yeah. Agreed. Agreed. So he had a pretty he had a pretty good um showing this time around. And then we had Dookie. Yes, his name's Dookie. <laughs> <laughs> at one and eight, like, two points. He said his name wrong. And then um, zero points, Ren Narita at 0 and 9. So I believe the last. At least Taka Michinoku wasn't the only one. There. I believe those two were, whatchamacallits, were, long, uh, were Young zero, Lions. Z- oh, Young Lions, that's yeah. fair. But fuck it, at least one of them has a, you know, yeah. got one win. And we heard some good things about uh, Narita. I think, um, think either, I think Yo said it. Yo said basically. He he has a future ahead of him, but today is just not his day. Yeah. So it's not the biggest. It's it's not a. It's kind that's, of, a, that's a. It's an endorsement. So yes, it's, it's like a know. back backhanded compliment. It's not a backhanded compliment. But it's an endorsement to me. It would be backhanded if you were like a, the age of a of vet. Exactly. If you were a, uh, or even you've been there for quite some time. Because they He's just brand got out of fucking... You know, yeah. They just got out of the Young Lions. Yeah, remember they were the Tempura Boys. They were the Tempura so, Boys, exactly. This um, is definitely true. So the final night we had... We started off with Dragon Lee, Shota Umino, and Titan defeating Bandido, Jonathan Grisham, and Red Narita. Um, good match. I, I, I honestly, I'm not going to lie, I didn't see the whole thing. I was just like, let me just see the main, main matches. Um, so... After this, we had the Bullet Club, El Fantasma, Robbie Eagles, and Taiji Ishimori defeating Rupangi 3K, Sho, and Yo, and um, Ryusuke Taguchi via pinfall, you know. Um, after that, we had Chaos, Tomohiro, uh, Tomohiro Ishii, Toruyano, and Yoshihashi. What? Oh, okay, this was a huge fucking thing. Okay, so it was a 10-man tag match. Yeah, I don't think yeah. I saw... I, I didn't, I see, didn't see this one. So, um, so we had Chaos, Somohiro Ishii, Toruyanu, Yoshihashi, and Jushin Thunder Liger and Tiger Mask 4 versus um, Suzuki Gunduki, Minoru Suzuki, Taichi, Yoshinobu Kanemaru, and Zack Sabre Jr. Um, pinfall with Karma from Tacos? On, I don't know what that means. But what are you... Why is, why is it like this? I, I hate don't, this I don't know what that means. What do you mean? It's going straight down. I, know, I just don't like it. <laughs> so after that, we had Los, Ingobern- uh, Los Ingobernables de Japón, Bushi, Evil, Sonata, and Tetsuya Naito over Great Bash Hill. I don't know what the fuck that is. Togi Makabe and Tomaoki Hanma, Kota Ibushi, and Toa Hanare. That's the name of their group. Come on, guess. man. They're the Great Bash. I don't know what they're bashing, but they're bashing shit. So then <laughs> we also had, you know, the, I mean, the thing is with these, like, with the best of the Super Juniors and tournaments like this with the G1, you're always going to get like a million tag matches before your main three matches. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. So, um, well, so shit, yeah, it's a lot of, But at least they're utilizing their talent yeah. to its fullest. Even if you're putting them in tag matches, it's still but quality you know what matches. it is? There's always a tournament. There is always There's a tournament. There's always a tournament, and in between the tournaments are the tag matches. Yeah. So To give you a little like rest by between they're worried crazy of, matches. Yeah, so yeah. it's not bad. It's... It's non. I'm okay with it. It's non American. It's more similar to non American Ring of Honor. Ring of Honor cares about the matches more than the the storylines. Because they don't have storylines. That's the thing about New Japan. They don't have storylines. What? I don't remember this episode. New Japan has storylines. You just can't really. They're not really. In, the storylines is they are in the match. That and they on don't top have, of that. On top of you're right, one hundred percent about yeah. that. But on top of that, their storylines are so long term, for the most part, in terms of how they set things up going yeah. into the future. They build a lot of relationships with everyone. Yeah, and sometimes you can be a passerby, or even if you're even if you're there for six you'll months, still be relevant. you can exactly. still be a passerby. It's like, um, they usually play the long game. They they treat it like an anime, dude. That's yeah, what they do. yeah, they do. So and then it's just it, yeah, yes, they definitely do treat yeah. it. They treat it like it's 
How long did it take to defeat Frieza? Goku versus Cell. No, Gohan Go- yeah, versus, versus Cell. Cell. Exactly. How long did that? It took Goku fucking. What was it? <laughs> like think five. Ten, five I think like episodes. Five hours fucking, though. Like five hours. So about eight, yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So about ten episodes just to kill Frieza, which is when not. He said, in five minutes, the yeah, world's gonna, the world's world's like, gonna blow what? up. It's been five minutes Anyways, for five for, <laughs> for like ten episodes. Five hours yeah, exactly. Um, so we had Kazuchika Okada and Rocky Romero for Chaos over the Villain Enterprises. Yeah. Brody King and Marty Skrull. It was whatever. Like yeah. I said, I I started watching it from there, and then I was just like, you know what? Let me just go to the singles match because that's why I'm here. So Switchblade Jay White once again defeated Hiroshi Tanahashi. The boy is good. I really good. He, he had his own honestly. He had so fast. So fast. You know what it is? He had that great loss at MSG. It was not like oh you're passing you're passing a title. No. You got it you were just a filler. Building story. No. You had it. You fought for it. You 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 lost it but it was a great fight. But he's right back in the right attention. back in the picture, yeah. and I like the the uh, even down. I like the new changes from it's not, it's not the clothes. It went from the clothes. And now it's the look. Now yeah. it's the facial not the hair. beard. When I saw him with the beard, I was like, and and I watched Community. I was like, I'll take you a lot more serious. Yes, like, yes. It's like not that I didn't take him serious before, but it's like it's but different. You got a beard. You got when you that have when you have anyway, dirt on your I face. I can't ever fucking grow for some reason because you know my genetics have failed it's, me. For this the most is part. this is this is all I'm getting right here. I'm like my it's, seventeen it's year old like cousins. My cousin's kid, a seventeen-year-old, had like a full fucking five o'clock shadow, like of a motherfucker. When I saw him like last weekend, I was just like, "Near his Why ass." Why can't I be like that? Near his ass. <laughs> <laughs> Near his ass. I but never yeah. noticed how big Ellie got. I noticed how big fucking Ellie got. Right? I didn't notice how big Chulupa Batman got. Cause that would have, cause that would have like even things out. Cause I saw how Chul- how big Chulupa Batman was in the last episode. I'm like, okay, that's not. I want a Chulupa Batman they- plushie. Like there has to be like an actual there. Chalupa yeah, Batman. There has to be. I mean, they have drawings. Chalupa Batman. There you go. And not like the kid, right? I don't know, but I'm, I'm mad it pops sure up. There are, you see Chalupa Batman. Okay. I want a Chalupa <laughs> Batman shirt. They, okay, no, you can find that. No, yeah, I'm pretty sure. If I go right to um, Etsy or if I go to Redbubble, I'm pretty sure I'll find a Chalupa Batman. And if you don't, oh yeah. Either know. either you look either you, you do see? it or baby Chalupa Batman. <laughs> so the next one of our friends that has a kid is getting a Chalupa, Chalupa Batman, Batman like yeah thing. So oh. just to let you know. Okay, but um, yeah, back to Switchblade. Switchblade has he's coming to his own very fast. Yeah, he's he's in that same timeline and league as austin theory uh velveteen yes. like they people they, that are really getting hitting their and they stride super pick early. up they pick it yeah. up very fast they pick it up very fast like leo rush is in that class as well jordan grace i don't put leo rush in that class yet i'm not saying he's not talented no no i'm but... saying but he's i'm saying he is because He's outside. He's outside of WWE for two years wrestling, and he did. Um, um, Don't get me wrong. He amateur wrestling, perfectly fine, and he got and, to WWE yeah. that way, which is great. But well, we don't. They don't showcase it that much, so we can't see. But I've seen. We, I've seen. We've seen stuff in Ring of Honor. I've seen stuff outside of everything else. I've seen things on YouTube too. So that's why I say that if they were to showcase it, it may change some things. Some people's visions but yeah 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 it's it's still a big class of people that's that are that's there that that's like just it yeah. yeah kofi Fair kingston's enough. definitely not in that he's old Facts. yeah it's it's um so yeah after that we had john moxie defeating juice robinson like i thought he would honestly i was like oh there he goes it was a it smart was a good, it, it was, was a smart thing to do it is because you give AEW more credence that way. I like, weirdly enough. I yes, and I don't know if if New Japan's doing that on purpose, but I also haven't seen AEW acknowledge his US Championship win. Have you? Not yet. Why didn't they acknowledge it? Already? I don't know. I haven't really been on social like that, but they should have. 
I I haven't been on their social rather. Uh, I've been on social. I don't I haven't been on their seeing social. anything pop up. I don't. Right? And they've been acknowledging a lot. They've been they they've they're acknowledging the fact. But they acknowledge the AAA because obviously they have the working relationship. But yeah. I yeah. don't know about. They're acknowledge, acknowledging a good amount of things right now. So yeah, they should have. They're. Their big other sign, their, their other big, new signing, big, their other signing. big signing, that was pretty yeah. much a coup. Um, they haven't, I haven't seen them acknowledge that yet. Um, speak. Wait, yeah, before you match. before you do anything, before you say anything else, I want to say I like the fact that John went to both. It it solidifies what he was saying in a Jericho interview. What do you uh, mean he went to both? Uh, AEW and New Japan. Well, yeah, he wanted to do it. I he know. signed the New Japan thing before he signed with AEW anyway. He did? Yeah. I don't know for how long. But he signed, I think he signed on to do, kind of like Jericho, to do a couple matches here and there. Okay. So, I, okay. Yeah. I, didn't, I didn't realize that. But I like the fact that he did both because it says more about solidifying exactly what he said in the Chris Jericho uh Mm-hmm. interview like i want i want to be i want to do this i want to be he creative to work, yeah everything that i everything the the way that we were doing things before wwe and now how they're doing things it's is completely different so yeah. it makes sense that he does both like i think he's having fun yeah it's a lot of it, having fun yeah again. yeah because him signing to aew solidifies him at solidifies aew a little bit yeah him doing both solidifies him yeah Agreed. So it's it's a really good move. What do you think? Well, we could. I don't want to talk about Kenta. We could get to Kenta when we get to the no, we'll get next to show. The next show, anyway. Um, and then after that, we had the fuck probably the match of the year so far. Honestly, to me, He's, Dragon Lee. No. What match was that? Osprey um, versus Shingo Takaki for the uh, you know for the final for the finals. Uh, yeah, I don't. Mm, I don't know. It's it's no, up there though. It's, it was that's the for me. That's the match of the year so far. Followed closely behind by like Adam Cole and uh, Johnny Gargano so far. Okay, I might have to watch that again. I'm gonna have to watch that again. This match, I was just like, it was like twelve thirty at night, and I'm watching it like this, like. The whole time, I was like, what the fuck are you guys doing? I'm going to watch it again. Because apparently I missed something. And no, I don't see anything on AEW's... They were killing each other. New J- AEW New Japan stuff. Yeah, So now, well, after I said that, he's moving to, to Japan and shit. I keep seeing Sadie Gibbs. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But yeah, that, that match was crazy. There were so many spots. I can't, I can't even remember all of them, honestly speaking. There were so many spots, so much crazy shit that they were doing. They they were both killing each other. And the sequences were fucking perfectly done the whole time. And that's what just built even more and more. From the beginning to the end, they went, I think, like half an hour straight. Like almost damn near full, full sprint the whole time. And it was fucking ridiculous. And I was just watching it like... You know... They were saying that um, I don't even care who won, who, who won. I was like, as, as long as they came out okay and like not hurt, I was like, I'm fine. But Will Osprey, he's a um, best of the Super Juniors 26 winner, so so that gave him a title match at Dominion, which we're mm-hmm. moving on to. Yeah. Now, um, but with all that being said, with with Osprey, right? Mm. Osprey. They said he never trained with weights before. Nope. N- bef- like he just only started. within the last six months. You can see how big he got yeah. in the last yeah. six months. Yeah, compared to six months ago, completely different. I like his chest is bigger, his shoulders are bigger, yeah. his back is way broader. Like, and I'm like, but okay, because that needs that after he got injured. After he got he injured, needs he needs that whole thing yeah. to be because he injured his neck, so he needs the neck muscles to to be good. That has to be supported by the fucking shoulders, by the traps, all that shit. So he had to get bigger in order for him not to, yeah. you know, not get, to get hurt again. Yeah, not to be badly injured the next time something possibly happened. Because it wasn't like he was skinny. He was just... But he was just... He, he just had an athletic build. Yeah, he had Now a, he yeah. has more of a build. He's getting closer to a build like... um, <sighs> Kind of looks more like Robbie Eagles. Yes, At this does. point. Yeah. And, uh... But not as big as, um... You just mentioned him. Velveteen? No, come back. Because he's kind of big. Like, he's kind of. He's yeah. getting to Velveteen levels. Yeah. 
but he's not as big as oh my god somebody in god. wwe no we he just said his name and we interviewed him i'm terrible austin theory yeah no theory. no he's not said it he's not close to there. that no no okay yeah, 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 yeah. i was just saying like he, he's closer to bubble team he is closer to bubble team you see bcw doing another show right yeah is he gone um, not him, but there's gonna be nah, people. Well, there. Well, we'll see. Wait, yeah. it's the June one, right? Mm-hmm. That one, Marty Bell, there, right? I feel like that's next weekend. Shit, I gotta check my schedule. Anyways, so talking Dominion. Um, so they actually started off with John Moxley versus Shota Umino, and uh, I think Shota Umino is a young lion heavyweight. Yeah, he is. And um, decent match, you know. And afterwards, he declared that he wants to go to the G one. Climax. Why? He's going to enter. What do you mean, why? No, like, <clears throat> why would they not acknowledge that? Oh, yeah. It's weird. I don't know why they're not acknowledging New Japan. Have you seen a Fighter Fest um, thing? It's the video moving. thing. I oh, know. No. The video thing. No. It looks like it looks like the Game of Thrones one. Oh, they're copying us. Though? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I've seen that. I've seen Theirs it. It's better, but you know, I, 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 I mean, seen it like four work. times, yeah. and I'm like, every time I see it, like, yeah, it has more. Work. Ours is better. <laughs> <laughs> um, the thing I liked, so he declared for the G1 that he wants to be in the G1 tournament that's coming up in July, and uh, uh, who showed showed up? No, Mina? John Moxley, um, asshole. I know. And then um, <laughs> what I liked was like he kind of is. I liked it, but it's kind of weird. He just took Shota Umino with him, and He's, he was like, "You're now my young lion." <laughs> like I'm like. Can I, you do that? I hope so. Uh, you know what? If he can, then fuck it. That's that's actually let him have a, a good, crew yeah. of super juniors. If they gave him that little, that'd be dope. <laughs> have a crew of super juniors. That'd not be even, dope. not even all over. Not no, heavyweights. Just, just, just super juniors. That'd be funny. Just, not um, even super yet. They're just but juniors. Young lions aren't only super juniors. I know. They're just you know? juniors. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that'd be dope though. Like he really like grabbed them, and I yeah. like the difference between both matches. Yeah, the match between him and Juice was just. Uh, it was. Oh my. god. God, we didn't really touch on it, but yo, that, Ju- you Juice, gotta watch that. Juice flipped Juice on him, died like a million times, and so did no. They both so did. so both did John, did. Um, and it was great. And yeah. it was an awesome. I don't know what to call him. I'm calling him Mox. Yeah, he went through the table. He went through and the table. His back too. That yeah, those tables are different, man. Yep. Either you go, th- you either want to go through it. You want to go. You have to go through it. It's not or, you want to. You man. have to go through it. Just to like get it done, so you Either, don't have to try to go through it again. No bouncing, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Those they look horrible, but he bit dude's face. Did you see? Did you? Juice see? bit him back. I know. Did yeah. you see the post interview match? The uh, post match interview thing that I sent. Mm-mm. It was just him. It was just Juice going off, just like oh, yeah, this motherfucker bit me. <laughs> <laughs> like oh my god. Um. So after that, we had Shingo Takagi. <laughs> Defeating Satoshi Kojima. So t- Satoshi Kojima is an old school um heavyweight. And yeah. Shingo Takagi was like, yo, I'm I'm clearly one of the best of the super juniors, and he is pretty much the biggest super junior. Yeah. Which is closest to the to a regular heavyweight. I'm pretty sure he was like two ten. I'm pretty sure he's in heavyweight. Yeah, because he's not that um, big, but he's not small at yeah, all. Exactly. And uh he's pretty much echoing what um what Will Ospreay said at the end of the match, like after he won Super Juniors, he was like, I don't only want to go against Super Juniors. He's like, I'm good enough to go against some heavyweights. Which now, with him gaining the weight, yeah, yeah he might be able he to. He might be able to. He definitely, if Shingo can, the, and he the defeated Shingo, then he can. that Will Ospreay picked up Jeff Cobb and did the storm you're right, break. You're right. I forgot about that. I completely forgot about that. That here right there. Yeah. He's an animal. Yeah. He's an and animal. That's probably when he started weight training, like just a couple months in. Like three, like... Two, two, two months, months yeah. better, two months ago, two three months ago, yeah. Where the fuck does time go? Exactly. But yeah, like he, yeah, he pretty much started at the beginning of the year. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> um, so then we had, I'm gonna rush through these. Then we had um the tag match, Jushin Thunder, yeah, Jushin Thunder Liger and Yoshihashi defeating Minoru Suzuki and Zack Saber Jr., which I didn't expect to happen. I, of course not. Nobody but... did, and when that happened, I was like, oh. Shit, I was like, all right. Yo, Mind you, when I woke up originally to watch this, I was like drifting in and out at three o'clock in the morning. <laughs> and I know I saw John Moxley defeat Shoto Uminu. And it was then over I after that. Up, <laughs> then I woke up somewhere between the Never Open Heavyweight Championship, like intermittent spots. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it was a good match. Yeah, Yoshihashi good... got the pin too, right? No, I think so. I, yeah, I think, I think so, Yoshihashi but did. Liger was pissed off with Yoshi. 
Because the, there was a moment where he he should have went for the tag, uh-huh. but he didn't go for the tag. Oh, uh, so and he was he like, was getting his ass. He was already getting his ass whooped. Yeah, and he still didn't go for the tag. And there was a moment where, um, Minoru Suzuki is just kicking him. Liger gets in, kicks him too, and said, "Go oh, for yeah. yes, it! Go for the team! Go that, for that the team!" That. that was the... like, did he just kick him? Yeah, yeah I remember he's that. like, yeah. That he's, he's, he's said, even even uh, uh, Liger's getting his shots yeah. in. It's like, yeah. yes, That's, like listen, funny. this is not a this like, is, come on, young buck. This is not one on one, and you can't, you barely doing it. Yeah, I think he pinned Zach, Zach Saber Jr. You know That's what he pinned? Yeah, yes, he did. Yeah. He did pin Zach. And Zach looked pissed. Yeah, because it didn't yeah, like, look like it was going to happen. Yeah, like a little temp- temper tantrum on yes, the way out, too. Of course. Yeah. I would have, too. He it's, got pinned by Yoshihashi. He's, he's Ring of Honor. That's all I was thinking <laughs> the whole match. Ring of Honor. You, <laughs> your hair is uh, not even, your hair is not even nice. Quote. Whoever said that shit on Twitter, that shit was funny. That's how much it just said Ring of Honor said Yoshihashi. <laughs> Yoshihashi of Wrestling Company. I was like, I wish he at least yeah, had nice yeah, hair. Yeah, sure. Like, if he had nice hair, I can get with it. I'd be a little happier. After that, we had <laughs> Hiroshi Tanahashi, Juice Robinson, and Yosuke Taguchi defeating Jay White, Chase Owens, and Taiji Ishimori, a.k.a. The Bullet Club. Um, pretty good match. That was a I, good, That's it, a good team it, right it, there. No, I like Jay. Yeah. I like Jay with, with Taiji and yeah. Chase. Chase is really good. I mean, you were going to get a lot of high flying and some slow down and technical work by Tanahashi Jay. and shit. Um, Risky Takuchi and Juice Robinson yeah. do the high flying thing. So Jay you have keeps like, it kind of fast paced. Yeah, Chase could kind of like bring it down as well with Yoshi, yeah. with um Tanahashi. So that that was a good match. Um, after that we had Tomohiro Ishii defeating Taichi to become the new never open weight champion, that was which we knew really, was gonna happen. I didn't want that to happen. It's Tomohiro Ishii. You know? I kn- I know you know, it's gonna happen. Stone Pitbull. It was a really good match though. It- I, that's the one I didn't see. I fell asleep on that one. It was a point in the match where Ishii is just kind of like, he's like slapping him around mm-hmm. about the gimmick. Like he pulls, well, he, yes, he pulls off something from him, from his, from his attire mm-hmm. or whatever. He's like, after he's on the floor, he's like, you don't even have to do it like this. <laughs> like you don't have, <laughs> you don't have to get win, win matches and be cared for like this. And coming from Ishii, Ishii is like, okay, one, you know, it's sure if it's coming yeah. from Ishii. Two, if Ishii's saying it, people are saying yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. Somebody's talking a, shit to you, which somebody's Ishii annoyed. don't be talking shit like that. Yeah, yeah. somebody's annoyed with your gimmick. His exactly. gimmick is really, it's old at this point. I like the whole Phantom of the Opera thing yeah, because we haven't like, seen it in a while. But it's... It's, it's, it's kind of like 10, 15 years old. Like Yes, it's a dead it's a dead gimmick. Yeah. Eat, freshen it up a little bit or yeah. or or do something else. Exactly. Keeping it doesn't really do anything, but... At least he's still getting matches. At yeah. least he's still getting title wins. I give him that. That's true. Although um, he didn't have it that long. I also didn't stay up for this one for the IWGP Tag Team Championship match because um I've seen this match a million times. Not to say that it's not good, but I we're no. getting to the point where it's um that's exactly what they DLG said. DLG and Evo Sonata for like the seventh time. They said the same thing. And so post match, I didn't go to see yeah. him on purpose. But I wasn't too hurt about missing it. Yeah, it's like okay, whoever wins wins. They yeah, got, they have another title. The the tag division is kind of weak at this point. Once you and that happens once you lose like the fucking best friends, the best friends, young bucks, the young bucks. Yeah, I mean Rapongi three K, they're in the title mix, but they're not really so it's not at, not during this. Yeah, so they thing, lost. Two, yeah. uh, they lost half of their actual like front facing tag teams. Mm. SEU doesn't count. They were Ring of Honor. But it still kind of counted. Could have counted Mm -hmm. because so was um, the Young Bucks. I don't know. That's the attack division is kind of weak right now. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. I like. That's, I really. That's the one thing I could fault them right now. Rewinding in my head right now, I really like how Ring of Honor used the hell out of the Young Bucks in the last two yep. to, two they to knew three months. Getting, yeah, they knew they had to get everything out. I, of I it. really like how they used them in the um, last two to three months. So it, the next match was the IWGP. Junior Heavyweight Championship match. Well, oh, Osprey. What? Wait, to go back to that, uh, G.O.D. did say that. That, that they, they're tired of... A, they need uh, they new need blood. Yeah, it's true. So, yeah. By the way, they retained their titles. You're right. You're right. You're right. They're right. Yeah. And if they're saying that, so the people in um in Ring of Honor. Yep. Because there's, there's really nobody for the Briscoes to fight. 
But the bouncers, I believe they're going to have a tag match coming up soon. Let's see. So um, we had Will Ospreay defeating Dragon Lee. This is my favorite match on the whole card. Um, amazing match, honestly. Amazing match. I mean, we know this is the thing. When you get one, they're really good friends. So when you fight your boys, you know be, what yeah, you can exactly. do. You know you what you can't can do, and you know how stuff, to yeah. tweak it a little bit, exactly. and then you and then you know how to take a bump a different type of way. Yeah. And boy, did they take bumps. Oh my! They're fucking God. nuts, and it was the best. On the card that yeah. night, I'm, I'm not going to say, or that morning. I like the next match, but it was not, it was just different. So, Will Ospreay, not cashed in, but you yeah. know, since he won, he had the number one contendership from the best of Super Juniors, and he won the Super Junior IWG, title. Yeah, the IWGP <laughs> Junior much. Heavyweight Championship. It's the Super um, Junior title. After that, we had the IWGP Intercontinental Championship match, Setsuya Naito defeating Kota Ibushi, where he almost fucking killed him. Now, this is... His neck I, went I'm, like I'm, this. I'm fine with... I'm going to play it right now so y'all can see it. Um, I'm fine with with them being super physical. Yeah. yeah. And, you know, they kind of take their, their pride off of wrestling the way they do. Yeah. And for the most part, I'd say about 90% of the time... They're safe with what they do for the most yeah, part. Yeah, they are. Um, minus Minoru, um, not Minoru. Um, yeah, Minoru. Um, Suzuki. Takahashi. Minoru Takahashi. That's his name, isn't it? The one with the cat. Tanahashi. No, no, no. Takahashi. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Right, the one that's out, but from Lij. Hiromu, my bad. There you go. Yeah, I was saying about Hiromu. Yeah, Takahashi. that's why I'm like, yeah. wait, what? Besides that, and besides what just happened today, there's not a lot of actual real like injuries. 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 It's just that it's, it looks take some hard bumps, but they won't. The, take. It's harder bumps in New Japan than they are anywhere else, pretty much. So, pretty much, barring those things. There was a moment where, what was it, a Snapdragon or was it a, no, it was a Huracan or some shit like that? No, it was a, a on, they were on the apron, it was, um, what should I call it? German. Right? Oh, it was a German suplex. I believe that okay. was a German. So it was a German suplex in which. I wish I had my, my laptop at this moment. Cause oh I've my been God, like this. It, it was pretty, it was pretty bad. It was a German suplex in which Naito did a German suplex. He took the bump of his life. To. Kota Ibushi, where his neck, I'm going to show it again, just like clangs off of the apron and, and it's, it's at a, like at a crazy angle. angle while he's falling, hits his head, and he looks like he's out. So, yeah. I'm pretty sure he was out for quite a few seconds. He was, I, he was, he he was to out be for out like 10 seconds. At least, at least. for a minute. I'm going to mm-hmm. go with a minute. And um, No, I'm saying like initially, like him like with his eyes closed, just on the floor. Wait a minute. Bad. A helicopter crashed on the building? We'll get to that. Yeah, and how I not fifty first and seventh. Yeah, you on top of a building, pretty close to your building. Pretty close, not yeah, pretty close. Two pretty abs, close, two abs over. Oh, two anyways, abs over. Anyways, it's anyways, a helicopter, it's fine, it's man. Fine, it's fine, it's fine. What do you mean? It's fine. Nobody got injured. Um, one, one person got injured. Is one person okay. dead. That's miraculous. So let's be happy that only one. person How is got that injured. miraculous? It's a helicopter. That only one person got injured after. It... That is miraculous. Okay, exactly. Um. <laughs> So, yeah, so he hit his head pretty bad, pretty fast. We're going to get back to that. And he looked like he was out cold for like 10 seconds and then he woke up. Red shoes. Should have stopped. New Japan, I get that you pride yourself on being tough and fighting spirit and, you know, this and that and all that stuff. I get it. It's part of your culture. No, no, it's part of their culture. It's part of their culture. It's it's the warrior spirit. No, it's their warrior spirit. Yes, it's the the warrior spirit in Spanish. It's the machismo. Yeah, it's the machismo, the fighting spirit. Like, that's what it is. But... When something like that happens, end the match next time because oh my Red Shoes God. had an obligation to end that match right then and there, and he didn't. And mind you, that's yeah, I it, woke up five it hit seconds over here, but his yeah. head it's the whiplash effect. I don't know how the fuck he kept his going. His body had to go like this yeah. pretty much. I don't know how he kept going. See? Yeah, exactly. It's a German. Exactly. I know. Oh, okay. There you that's go. crazy. Um. Yeah, that was nuts. Cut the match next time. I mean, it still went out to be an and amazing you, match afterwards. But and you see he did it. He could have gotten way more hurt. Yeah. Had you, there been something You know what wrong. it is? 
Because that's almost an automatic concussion. And yeah. I don't know how they just... He pulled cut. it to the side a little bit. Well, he's, his body was tw- uh, was twisted yeah. to the side. But you see, uh, like, no, you man. can tell... It scared the fuck out of me yeah. at five it's, in the morning. It still looks accidental. Yeah. No, it was accidental for sure. But cut it next time, please. Yeah. Because, mm-hmm. yeah, that's that's a no-no. With any other sport, any other, any other promotion, I think would have stopped it right there. Yeah, or or made a scene out of trying yeah, to stop it exactly. at least. Yeah, and to give him time to recover at yeah. least or whatever. Mm-hmm. Um, and then after that, we had the IWGP Heavyweight Championship match, Okada versus Jericho, which was good. That was and my second. It. That was my second favorite match, though. The, the Naito, Naito yeah, and, yeah. and Ibushi. Yeah. That was my second Same. favorite, just because up until that point, even with that. Even with that, it was even still a great after match. Yeah. it was crazy. I don't know how he found his feet, but he did. I don't know how he didn't mention the super duper um, Oz cutter. I know. It's just, <laughs> just go watch the match. Honestly, he it's hopped up. Nuts. Oh, yeah. oh, it's like wait, yeah. what? Yeah, I know, I know. And then he held on, turned to into do the it sto- again. Exactly, turned into yep. the stormbreaker. Jesus Christ! Once I saw the the finishing <laughs> touches, once he hit him with the yeah. With the elbow, and then he went to doing all that stuff. Like, once he hit him with the elbow, the I was elbow, like, finishing sequence. The boom, boom. Oh, this is so anime right here. Yeah. Because in an anime fight, you go into your you finishing sequence. Every like, three moves. You, yeah. And that's that's pretty much that it. That was a great um, sequence. Is the elbow. Yeah. The, uh, it was, yeah, the elbow. Elbow to the Oz Cutter. Oz Cutter, Stormbreaker. And then to the Stormbreaker, yeah. I forgot what the elbow was done. called, though. Um, oh, my God. Did, wait, speaking of the elbows. The blind elbow or something like that? Sounds about right. Something did like that. Did Jericho get to do his elbow on? I don't think he did. Because I didn't get to see I don't think he thing. did. Um, it was a good match. It wasn't the best one. And it kind of ended on a roll-up, I think. If I remember correctly. Aww. Or some type of pin. Jericho. So that's why Jericho kidding. still went after him afterwards. You know, And that's why Okada whooped him Okada out. Was, yeah, Because I saw that. I didn't well, Okada didn't whoop him out afterwards. I mean, Tana. Tanahashi came out. Gosh. So Okada whooped him out and everything. Still a good thing. Still a good um overall card. Good card. And, really um, good card. Pay-per-view. I'm still going with the seven match. What do you give it? Out of ten, might be a good seven. I gave it a yeah. I give it a I give it like a seven and a half, seven point two five. I think if we both average it out, it comes out to like seven point two five. Yeah. So that's what we got, seven point two five. And um, I think that's seven and a quarter. I don't even want to go over Super Showdown, honestly. All I know, honestly, because we didn't watch it, <laughs> all I know is that. Bill Goldberg knocked himself out trying to do a. I didn't know that until monster. just now when you told me earlier. Yeah, so like, it's not just now. But I yeah. didn't watch it, and I don't even know what happened because it's getting that bad to the point where I just see reports about are the they wrestlers still, being unhappy about. Are they still shit, stuck so. in the past? Of course they are. Not WWE, just that area of India. Saudi Arabia. Excuse me. Excuse, yes, yes. Saudi Arabia. Yeah, just that, just that area of Saudi Arabia. They have to be in the past. I think so. Because if you want Undertaker and it's like it's I'm like taking, Borat, I'm Miami taking, Vice number one new show. Yeah, that's, yes, that's what it is. Yes, that's honestly it what definitely it is. is. What's um? I bet you if we put Attitude Era shit for them now, they'll start you, cheering for the rock, the rock Euro and trip. That shit. Yeah, yeah. When they went to Old Berlin. Mm-hmm. And, what was it, Urban? Or oh, no, East Germany. I think it was no, no, no. East it was, Berlin. No, Whatever it wasn't it even was. Germany. That shit was, uh, it was like one of the Slavic countries. Yeah, it was. Yeah. 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 They, were, they were totally behind. But yeah, yeah this is crazy. Like, yeah. Sorry, WWE people. Every, they're I, doing money grabs. They, they're fucking up, honestly, Yeah, at this like point. these are not to bad the point matches. Where I'm not caring. It's not bad matches. It's just no, matches. I just we don't, don't care. Wanna see. Yeah. I just don't care. I honestly don't care about WWE right now. And it's they they started fine with WrestleMania this year, and then after that, it's just a fucking. You know why? Because when you end WrestleMania, dive. is that you have to re- you you start new, and they need to stop thinking that. No, you got to keep going now. Exactly. Keep you it. Keep it, going. It, yeah. They because have other to. promotions don't do that. Exactly. Like well, whatever. Okay. And cool. if you're gonna do that, have two months off. You might as well. Exactly. You and rewrite well. new shit. Because somebody needs... Been saying it for years. But somebody whatever. needs a damn mind cleanse over there, but... Ah, uh, man. Mm-hmm. That was a 10-minute main event. Mm-hmm. Undertaker and Goldberg. I, that, that shouldn't have been the main event. I don't care. Like I said. Um, so, I think I we wanna, hit our time I want to watch Kofi and Dolph. You go watch it then. 
Um, we had a time limit. We've been watching. We're pretty much done. Stop, and stop, 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 stop. We're done. <laughs> we were over our time limit. I don't want to watch another. <laughs> <laughs> that being said, thanks for watching episode 127 of I Pokes and Head Chokes. You can follow us on Twitter at Pokes and Chokes. Myself at underscore Mr. Alex 25 underscore the guy on my left at N U underscore K E W L A. You sounded like you were trying to take a yeah. shit. Ah. On Instagram, at Instagram. On Instagram, at Pokes and Chokes. What is it? Pokes and chokes. No, it's not. It's Pokes Chokes podcast. There you go. Yeah. It's gonna be down here. Whatever. Yeah, so yeah. I'll be things, I, Facebook, exactly. Patreon. All the time. And also we changed our logo to support Pride Month. So Hey y'all. Yeah. Um, that wasn't even gay, that was country. Whatever. I I didn't Country say people anything. are gay, so I don't know. So you're digging yourself into a hole. No, it, <laughs> no, no, no. It wasn't trying to be a hole or it was, I wasn't trying to clean anything up. I was just saying. Mm. We support you. We support. So, yeah. We'll catch you guys next week. Thanks for watching. And um, There's more stuff happening. I know there's something out. we're forgetting. I we know it's something already. we're forgetting. Too late. Bye. No. No.